Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss the following question, and the question says: A man wants to buy 62 shares available at $132, par value being $100. One, how much will he have to invest? Two, if the dividend is 7.5 percent, what will be his annual income? Three. If he wants to increase his annual income by one fifty dollars, how many extra shares should he buy? Let's start the solution now. We will solve part one first. In part one, we have to find how much will he have to invest. We are given that market value of one share. Is one thirty-two dollars, and the man wants to buy sixty-two shares. So, the sum invested by the man on the shares is equal to number of shares into market value of one share. Now this is equal to number of shares, which is 62, into market value of one share, which is given to be 132 dollars. This is equal to 8,184 dollars. So the answer for part one is sum invested is equal to. Eight thousand one hundred eighty-four dollars. Now we will solve part two. In part two, we have to find his annual income, and we are given that dividend is seven point five percent. First, we will find dividend on one share. Now this is equal to. 7.5 percent of the par value, which is given to be hundred dollars. So we write hundred dollars. This is equal to 7.5 upon hundred into hundred dollars. Zeros get cancelled, and this is equal to. Seven point five zero dollars. Hence, his annual income is equal to total number of shares, which is given to be sixty-two. So we have sixty-two into dividend on one share, which is seven point five zero dollars. And this is equal to four hundred sixty-five dollars. So the answer for part two is annual income is equal to four hundred sixty-five dollars. We now move on to part three. In part three, we are given. That the man wants to increase his annual income by one fifty dollars, we have to find how many extra shares should he buy. So we can say that since the man wants to increase his annual income. By one fifty dollars, and in part two we calculated the dividend on one share is seven point five zero dollars. So we have, and the income on one share 
is equal to seven point five zero dollars. Therefore, number of extra shares. He must buy is equal to the amount by which he wants to increase his annual income, that is one fifty dollars, upon the income on one share, which is seven point five zero dollars. Now we remove the decimal, so this is equal to one fifty. Upon seven fifty into hundred, this zero gets cancelled, and fifteen five times is seventy five, and five twenty times is hundred. So this is equal to twenty. So we can say that hence the extra shares. To be bought is equal to twenty. This is the answer for part three. With this, we end our session. Hope you enjoyed the session.